Conveyor System Safety, Hazards and Remedies. In today's fast-paced supply chain environment, conveyor systems are crucial for maintaining efficiency and productivity. As the speed and volume of these systems increase, so does the risk of serious injury for those who operate and maintain them. While technology advances, the core principles of safety management remain the same. Identify, control, reduce, and eliminate risks. Using these tools, let's explore the potential hazards and essential safety measures for working around conveyor systems. Distribution and manufacturing spaces often include non-direct workers who navigate through and around conveyor systems, providing support like transporting supplies and assisting warehouse personnel. To ensure the safety of all workers, designate clear pathways for pedestrian and vehicle traffic. Install bollards, impact railing, machine guarding, and overhead safety netting around conveyor systems. Operators and maintenance teams directly interacting with conveyor equipment face hazards such as entanglement or crushing from exposed moving parts. Even slow-moving conveyors present risks. Sortation involves significant twisting, lifting, and repetitive movements, posing ergonomic challenges. Induction workers using extendable conveyor equipment in trailers encounter hazards such as trips, slips, falls, low lighting, and tight spaces. Furthermore, complex system configurations can cause tripping and head bumps for all frontline team members. Despite advanced automation technology, human intervention is often necessary to keep products moving smoothly. Safety best practices begin with 360 awareness, individual care to tuck in loose clothing, remove jewelry, and secure long hair. Maintenance teams face fall hazards from working overhead, requiring ladder enclosures, guardrails, and personal fall arrest systems. Conveyor systems can cause harm through electrical energy, necessitating system shutdowns. Issues like jams may be resolved with an e-stop, while complex situations require lockout, tagout procedures, or lotto, to ensure complete deactivation. Safety leaders are responsible to provide clear direction on safe work habits, and how to identify hazards and execute remedies so all teams can work safely and efficiently in ever-evolving material handling workplaces.